Nation. So tell me about this sneaker fetish. I'm a sneakerhead. What's going on, YouTube? What's going on, sneakerheads? It's your man, AJ. I'm back again with another Peep My Exclusive. It's been a long time, but I'm here to show you a few new things. Well, more like two new pairs of shoes. Um, as you can see the name in the title. Well, hope you enjoy. So today I'm about to show you a new pack that's coming out. There's no official release day yet, but I did um, post a picture, a few pictures on Instagram and on uh, Facebook on Cream and I mean, this morning I woke up and I checked like every sneaker site, took my pictures, posted them as their own, saying that, you know, they have them and this and that. I'm cool with, you know, people using my early release pictures. I mean, I don't post that many, but, you know, give me credit, but I'm not mad. I'm just here to show you the video. So today we're going to do the rival pack. This is what the box looks like. It's got the, you know, the original AJKO. Um, this is what the front looks like. So try to get that in the camera. There we go. And there's the tag. If you, let me see if we can get that in there. So the color code for this one is 655-328 and 900. So it's multicolor. Um, Official release date, like I said, I'm not sure. Um, my connect is very, very, very um, in the Jordan brand, you know, company. So I do get a lot of uh, early releases. I don't ask for stuff, so when they send it to me, it's, it's a plus. But this is the first one, is the Georgetown. Uh, it's a nice, I don't know if you can really pick it up in the video, but it is that uh, dark blue with the little gray um i think what would look awesome on it if somewhere they did have uh the actual logo when you open it up it's just a shoe so here it is this is the side angle and it is the whole shoe is canvas for people who know the AJKOs are majority of them are all canvas. Um, it's not a review review, it's just kind of like going over it a little bit, but it does have the Nike here. Let me check, I, don't, I haven't even unlaced these. They just actually came in yesterday. And they do have the Nike on the inside. Check that out, uh, just right there. Um, that's so what I see. I don't see any jump man on this shoe. You Nike on the bottom. Uh, let me see the material. Um, the straps up here kind of, I don't know if it's like really a leather, but it's really hard leather. You know, it's a really hard leather. Um, it's as, same for as a swoosh. It's like, I don't know, try to get closer. Can't really feel it. You're not going to feel it, but. Um, but other than that, it's just mesh, whatever mesh feels like, I mean, not mesh, uh, canvas. Um, only thing I don't like about them is this little, this little, uh, heel dip, but I mean, it's a nice shoe. All over, it is a nice shoe. Get another one for you. This is what it looks like in the front. Side angle. The back. Inside. There we go. You know what these shoes actually really remind me of? For those who are like been in the you know been into the shoe game. I don't know if y'all remember I think the Air Terminators or something like that it was like a majority was like black and silver. That's what it kind of feels like to me. So let's get to uh let's get to actually even the papers got all the logos all over them. 
Stop. Probably, you can't really see them. I'm not using my SLR. I'm using the built-in camera. It's kind of late. But let's get to the North Carolina one. This is the one I really like. Once again, here is the regular block. Again, if it had a Tar Heel on it, I think it would look dope. Super dope. Same here. See, it's the all white. My only problem with this is I feel that this is going to get dirty super fast. So you got to use a whole lot of the water protectant on it. Same with this. The material up here is the exact same as the Georgetown one. It's a really hard um, leather. Uh, but this also does have, this one has like, a, this one also has like a mesh tongue. Full canvas all the way around. Nike over here. Check the inside on this one. It does have oh, where is that thing? Nike on the inside, Nike on the bottom. I think it'd be really cool if they did had like somewhere like a Tar Heel. Like if they had since they have the AJK over right here, just have like a Tar Heel logo. I'd be a lot smoother. I don't know if you can get kind of get the angle, but it's nice. It is a nice shoe. Both together. Right here. Outside. Bottoms. And the inside, the back. Um, like I said, I think these are dope. I like them. Um, let me know what you think. Uh, a lot of people that I've seen on like Soul Collector or Nike Town, or Nike Talk, I mean, that I've been posting them, saying that they do like them, uh, but they would like to have them individually instead of a uh, pack. But I don't know what the price point is. I don't have, most likely it'd be like maybe 280. I know it shouldn't be, it couldn't be over 300, two, over 300 for some Jordan 1s. Um, but other than that, man, that's basically it. This wasn't a review review. I will do an on-feed stuff later. Uh, I do have a few other samples that came in. Uh, some 11s and 4s and stuff like that that were sent to me. Um, some I can't really show, but maybe a sneak peek on Instagram. Check out the Instagram. Follow. And if you inbox me, maybe I'll send you some exclusive pictures. Peace. <laughs> What is this? Ammunition. 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 Ammunition.